wildlife photography is all about the right moment. You might be waiting for the right moment for hours or even days. And when that desired moment comes, failing to capture the moment would be the last thing a wildlife photographer would ever want. So in order to capture the right photo at the right moment without fail, you certainly need the best kind of wildlife photography camera that comes with enough speed, adequate autofocus, and other features. And to lessen your burden of choosing the right camera, we're going to show you the best wildlife photography camera to satisfy your varying needs. So let's start the adventurous search for the wildest camera for you. At Camera Zone, our mission is to provide the most reliable updates of photography and cinematography gear, including expert opinion based on their performance and value. First, we're going to discuss the Sony A92, a mirrorless camera that comes in a compact form factor yet retains stunning features for wildlife photography. Equipped with a 24.2 megapixel Exmor RS BSI stacked full frame CMOS sensor and Bionz X processor, this camera is capable of capturing a whopping 20 frames per second with its blackout free 3.7 million dot OLED electronic viewfinder. Equipped with a stacked sensor, this camera is capable of providing lesser noise at higher ISO, better low-light performance, and stunning highlight and shadow details. As for the autofocus, this camera features 693 points of phase detection as well as 425 points of contrast detection that covers 93.7% of the frame and provides rapid and accurate focusing. Besides, its real-time eye autofocus can detect animal eyes and track moving animals effectively. For faster file storage, this camera supports dual UHS-2 SD memory card slots. Bottom line, the Sony A92 is a speed master and perfect for capturing fast-paced scenarios in the wilderness. So, if you are more into shooting a running tiger after its prey or a flying bird, then the Sony A92 is an ideal camera for you. Next, let's move on to the Fujifilm X-T4, a mirrorless APS-C camera featuring incredible speed as well as superb image stabilization that comes with an affordable price tag. Featuring a 26.1 megapixel APS-C X-Trans BSI CMOS 4 sensor along with X Processor 4, this camera can reduce the rolling shutter effect and perform with faster read speed. Moreover, it comes with a fast burst speed of 15 frames per second. Besides, it comes with dual SD UHS-2 memory card slots offering quick data transmission. Additionally, it features in-body image stabilization that smooths out footage up to 6.5 stops and ease handheld shooting in the wilderness. The X-T4 also includes hybrid autofocus featuring 425 phase detection points along with a contrast detection system so that you can click tack sharp images of flying birds and fast moving animals without breaking a sweat. And there is also a crop factor when using a lens, so you will get a little more reach when using a lens on this camera. So the Fujifilm X-T4 is the best camera for those who are looking for the best APS-C camera for wildlife shooting that features incredible autofocus and outstanding stabilization. Now let's talk about the Olympus OM-D EM-1 Mark III, one of the best micro four-thirds cameras ever made. Perfect for fast-paced scenarios like wildlife shooting. Now you might be wondering why we should use a micro four-thirds camera in wildlife photography. Well, the reason is, you will get two times crop factor. So if you attach a 300mm lens, you will get a focal length of 600mm with a micro four-thirds camera because of its crop factor. The Olympus EM-1 Mark III comes with a 20 megapixel live MOS micro four-thirds sensor and True Pick 9 processor. This camera is literally a speed demon and capable of shooting 60 frames per second with an electronic shutter and 15 frames per second with a mechanical shutter. As far as stabilization is concerned, 
We all know that Olympus camera features industry-leading stabilization. EM1 Mark III is no different from the others and provides a whopping 7.5 stops of in-body image stabilization. Apart from that, it comes with 121 points of phase detection and contrast detection cross-type autofocus to keep your subject in focus. It also comes with dual SD memory card slot for faster data storage as well as weather sealing features to protect your precious camera from harsh weather conditions in the wilderness. In summary, Olympus OMD EM1 Mark III is everything you will find in a high-end camera plus a longer focal length for your lenses and of course, in a more affordable price range. Next, we have the Canon EOS R6, a speed beast with superb autofocus and impressive stabilization. This phenomenal mirrorless full-frame camera comes with a 20-megapixel CMOS sensor along with a Digic X processor which makes it fast enough to take 12 frames per second. Moreover, with dual UHS-2 SD card slots, the performance becomes significantly fast. This camera is perfect for wildlife photography as it features 1053 selectable points of dual pixel CMOS autofocus, which is fast and precise. The focusing has been improved further with deep learning technology and is capable of accurate face, head, and eye detection for both people and animals. To make your wildlife handheld shooting experience even easier, this camera also includes in-body image stabilization up to 8 stops. So overall, the Canon EOS R6 is a powerful camera with exceptional stabilization and autofocus and best suited for wildlife enthusiasts. Lastly. We're going to talk about the best DSLR ever made for wildlife photography, the Nikon D850. The Nikon comes with everything a wildlife photographer could wish for, from superb sensor to stunning autofocus, from excellent ISO performance to better burst shooting. Equipped with a high-quality 45.7 megapixel BSI full-frame CMOS sensor along with a Speed 5 image processor, this camera can tag sharp images with incredible details as its ISO can get as low as 64. It can shoot around 7 frames per second for 51 images with auto exposure and autofocus turned on which is adequate for wildlife shooting. If you want more burst speed on your hands, you can use a high power battery and enjoy 9 frames per second. With multi-cam 20K autofocus system and 153 phase detection points, this camera ensures that each of your shots look crisp sharp. Moreover, there is XQD and UHS-2 compatible SD memory card slots for flexible file storage. Apart from that, its VSI sensor design also provides significant low-light performance. Besides, it can brighten your image during nighttime shootings as it can produce stunning images even at higher ISO. Because of its minus 4 exposure value low-light sensitivity, it can focus in even nearly dark situations. In short, if you are looking for the best camera that combines higher resolution with excellent speed, the Nikon D850 is the best choice for you. So that's all about the best camera for wildlife photography. All the cameras have distinguishing characteristics to serve specific wildlife photography needs. We have also covered wildlife photography cameras for professionals and budget users as well. So which one do you like the most? Let us know in the comment section. Thanks for watching. We always crave to learn more. If you think we missed a product or another needed to add, we'd love to hear yours.